Okay, so a while back I did a video on how to use my Juki here, which is an industrial sewing machine. The exact model is the Juki DDL8700. And since then I've had a few comments and questions come in. I got this really sweet one over the weekend that I just want to address. It was really sweet but also quite disheartening as well. Um, I will cross the person's name out but they are starting a new job and basically want to know how to slow the machine down. They're a bit embarrassed to ask and the previous person did the job for 30 years and used the machine at full speed. So they want to know how to slow it down themselves which I will show you in this video. Do not be embarrassed. I actually did look around just YouTube and the internet on how to slow it down but I couldn't find a explanation for this particular model of Juki that I have so I had to find my manual that I've kept from the first time I bought the machine and it explains it here so I will show you you know in this in this video also someone else has asked about the foot pedal control on my Juki this you can also use to control the speed and I'll do an explanation on that also. To change the speed, turn your machine on and it will start by showing you the lights here. At the bottom, there's the P and the S. So the first button you're gonna press is the P and then it will change to this shape and then S, I'm guessing S is for speed. So click on that and this is the current speed that my machine is on. It's set to 3.6. So to change the speed, you press S again and you can see here it's a blinking light so as it is now it's ready to be changed so press this s button again and this will increase it upwards so continue to press it until it starts again at 0 0.5 so i'm guessing it's on all jukies but on my jukie the lowest is a 0 0.5 but let's say you want to go a bit higher, you press that and then you press P and then P again and this saves the setting. So now my machine is set to the lowest which is 0 0.5 and I'm just, I've just done this to show you the speed. So no matter how fast you press the foot pedal, this is the maximum speed the machine is ever going to achieve because that's what it's set at so i'll put my needle down and i'm pressing the absolute hardest and this is the fastest speed and if you press very gently on your foot pedal this is you can even achieve a slower speed than this And now I've set my machine to 4, which is the highest speed setting, just to show you how fast it can go when you press your foot pedal on full speed. So don't set this if you're not confident. I'm just showing both ways so that people know. And I'm going to press absolute fastest and you see how fast it will go which is really really fast so yeah of course if you're not comfortable don't set it at this speed this at the bottom of your sewing machine is the foot pedal and you use this to control the speed on your sewing machine and just a safety tip you are not meant to use you know sandals or open toe shoes you're meant to use proper you know proper shoes um just for safety reasons but I'm not on a factory floor. I use this machine. 
at home so I normally just wear slippers or sometimes I'm even barefoot but I have to relay this information so that I'm not encouraging um, unsafe practices but yeah to control the pedal you just put your your foot on it and very gentle movements because this is really sensitive so I'm gonna press down on it and you see how it goes and hopefully you can hear by the intensity of the machine if I press my pedal all the way down then you're gonna get the fastest speed right but if you press gently then the speed is going to be more gentle so just bear that in mind and this is about medium so you just gauge it and as your you know as your feet get more comfortable then you know what you need to do i know it's been a minute since my last upload but happy to say i'm back now and i've had a few new piercings since then i got my nose done and a few on my ear as well which i really love um to the person that asked this question i hope it's answered it and that you're able to slow your machine down good luck at your new job um don't ever be embarrassed to ask questions okay if you have any more questions for me put them down in the comments below and if you like fashion and sewing content and you're looking to learn a bit more in those areas subscribe to this channel i got you covered um i'm on instagram i'm on tiktok i'm even on pinterest so you guys can keep up with me on there as well and see you in the next video thank you guys Mwah.